live each day like it's your last. If someone means something to you, let them know. Because if you don't, you're doing a disservice for them and yourself. And so I went home that day and I told her, I said, Amanda, I adore you. And, and I've known since the day I met her. The first time I came over to study with her, that she was just a different type of woman. The hands you're holding are the hands of your best friend. They're young and strong and full of love for each of you, as you promise to stand by each other tomorrow, today, forever. These are the hands that will work alongside yours. As you build your future together, these are the hands that will hold you when you're overcome by grief or by fear. These are the hands that will wipe tears from your eyes, whether they be from sorrow or joy. And most importantly, these are the hands that will hold your family together as one and give you the strength when you need it. I was recently asked by some friends, how do you know this is the right man to marry your daughter? I got that answer one day uh, a few years ago. I was very lucky to catch a glimpse of love that was going on between these two. It was about on Thanksgiving oh, about two years ago. I saw Amanda looking up at Chandler in a way that I had never seen her look before. There was so, so much adoration in her eyes. I knew that she was in love and I knew that this was the man she wanted to marry. And I see a team with the two of them. And through the years, I've watched the two of them grow in a beautiful way. They're a team, they work together, they're caring and loving. So what I want you to work on and, and make sure that you never forget about is basic communication and always focus on that meaningful, you know, understanding, loving, respectful communication with one another. Chandler, you know that Amanda is our greatest treasure, our sunshine and our light. And I know that you'll protect her, love her, and feed her macaroni and cheese on her bad days. I love you with all my heart. I am so lucky to have met you in that English class. You are my driving factor. You make me want to be better. You show me what love is and what love can be. I choose you today because you are my provider, my teacher, my protector, and my best friend. When I think about that 20-year-old girl standing in the lobby waiting for a duck shirt wearing, hot chocolate carrying boy. She really had no idea that the next four and a half years would bring more laughter, more learning, and more happiness than she could have ever imagined. Because of you, I look forward to every day. There's no bad days with you. I am so proud of what we've become. Through the challenges we've faced, the major life moments that we've shared together, the small, goofy family that we've built. Our foundation is what makes us the amazing team that we are today. I am committed to being the best team member, friend, and wife that I can possibly be. I want to make you these promises because you deserve this and so much more. I'm so glad you're going to be my daughter-in-law. I promise that you and me will always work. I promise that you are and will always be my number one. I promise to always work on us, good times or bad. I promise to love you, even when I don't like you. I promise to love you even when I'm hungry. And I promise to love you even when we fight. I promise you that no matter how good or how bad things may be, I will never stop trying. Trying to make you laugh 
trying to understand your feelings, trying to be open and honest at all times, and even trying to be a more involved football fan. I am constantly inspired by the way that you choose to love me every day. I promise to always be on your team. We may not always see eye to eye, and I accept that we have our differences, but I will always love, honor, and respect you. I know that we can be guiding lights for each other in times of uncertainty and doubt. We may be strong individuals, but I always believe that we are stronger yet together. And lastly, I promise that I will always show you my love. And this one means a lot to me, and not because I want nice things done for me, but because you deserve every single second of it. You are the most amazing, strong, and selfless man that I've ever met. So please, laugh with me, confide in me, travel with me, lean on me and cry with me, because I will be there right next to you, ready to take on this world together. I'm so excited to see what God's plan has in store for our marriage, because it'll be a privilege to experience it with my best friend. You are my best friend. I'm so honored and lucky to be able to call you my wife. I adore you. I love you, but mostly I adore you.